All right, we have all the flooring done in this place. Finally took a couple days, got all the closets done, everything. It looks so good, guys. Over here, just throw the bathroom. That closet is done. All of this. This closet done over there. And this closet. So, uh, I gotta go ahead and clean all this up. It is pretty messy. You can see how much just like material has accumulated down here. It's crazy. Look at this. So, a ton. I think next time if I ever do this, I might get one a, uh, a vinyl cutter. It's kind of like a guillotine, it just chops it. This just makes so much mess. But you pretty much have to use a table saw when you want to do long ripping. So you can't get away from that. You can just see this stuff, it's all over the wall. So I'm gonna go ahead, fire up the shop vac, clean all this up. All right, this is the new vanity we just bought. I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it and uh, try to get it into the other room. It's like 170 pounds, it's got a full stone slab on top, so this should be interesting. So guys, we just got the vanity in here. It looks good. Just one slight problem. Hi. The water lines are hitting the back brace here. So I'm gonna go ahead and just cut some of this right here. And then uh, the plumbing, the drain down there is also hitting here. So I'm gonna have to cut that out. So I guess we'll do that. All right guys, I just threw these in here. Look how good this looks. I think it looks so good, that oil rub rounds. Well, I'm gonna keep going. I wanna get this thing working here. Let's get the plumbing down here done. All right guys, so I got everything together here. What a nightmare again we had. So I bought this faucet set on uh, Amazon, not this one, the one you guys saw me installing. And um, I went to put the, this guy in here and when you would push down on this, it would get stuck. It would not, like when you push down, it would not pop back up. Um, so I thought about it. A brand new one of these guys at like the Home Depot or Lowe's was like 40 bucks and I had paid 65 for the faucet. So at that point I'm at $105. Um, I, I just figured, let me return that to Amazon and I'll go buy this Moen set. This was $125. I mean, it looks identical. It's a, probably a better quality. Um, and uh, I obviously don't have that issue anymore. So um, I just kind of wish I would have just done that from the get go, but you know, you try to save money. That is what it is. So. Have that installed, it looks great. Um, you can see all the plumbing I had to do down there. I ended up having to buy an extension piece, 12 inch. 
and you can see where the water line is hooked up. So looks really, really nice. Um, and in the meantime, I did not film this, but I just went and cut all of the shoe molding for the entire place. Took me a whole day basically, maybe half a day, three quarters of a day. But I cut all the shoe molding. None of it is attached, it's just sitting there in front of it. Um, and you can see I have more in this room. I also cut all the trim that has to go around this shower. It was, it was really time consuming and I figured, you know, I didn't want to bore you guys. So I cut all that and it's all ready. I have it right here, ready to be attached. So I think I will set up the camera. I will uh, I'll film installing all that. It's, it's really gonna make this place look pretty good. It's, you know, that's kind of the last part. It's unfinished. So we'll do that. And then I'd like to get all the shoe molding tacked in in this room. So looking pretty dang good. Stay tuned. <laughs> 